Hello and welcome back to MyMetaverseMinute.com, your place for the latest news, views and opinions from the metaverse. Today's episode is brought to you by Cloud Wars Expo, running 28th to the 30th of June at the Moscone Center in San Francisco. I will be there leading tracks and sessions alongside Bob Evans, the founder of Cloud Wars, and the rest of my Acceleration Economy Analyst colleagues. You can go to CloudWarsExpo.com to learn more and join me there. Join thousands of CXOs June 28th to 30th in San Francisco, California at Cloud Wars Expo as we explore a new metric called the Time to Dazzle, exclusively focused on how long it takes to dazzle customers with new business models that are enabled by the cloud, empowered by AI, and optimized with human ingenuity. Register today at cloudwarsexpo.com and join a movement to make dazzling customers the metric that matters. In today's My Metaverse Minute, I want to give you the heads up about what to expect in the next newsletter. Of course, if you're not a subscriber to My Metaverse Minute, you won't receive our newsletter, but it's very easy to get on board. All you need to do is visit our website, subscribe there, it takes about two minutes, and you'll be receiving the same in-depth, exclusive content that all of our subscribers currently do. Well, in this week's newsletter, I want to talk about the next generation of VR, and that is thought control. There are already companies um, working on projects that will provide VR experiences that are controlled solely with the mind, through electrical impulses through the mind. I want to tell you about what some of those um, products are. I want to let you know when to expect them to become on, to come on market, when they're going to be commercially available. And I want to go into a little bit of a discussion about the ethics of this, how this level of immersion could play out in terms of um, the mental health of users, and also how it will be regulated. How will our thoughts, um, if we're controlling our metaverse experiences with our thoughts, how will that be regulated? How can we stop things from happening that we may not want to happen within the metaverse space? All that is coming in this week's newsletter. Uh, as always, stay tuned and stay curious.